Yo, just pulled up to Seymour Smith Skate Park in Omaha, Nebraska. This park is pretty big. I think this is gonna be one of the bigger parks that I've been to on this trip so far. I've been here before several years ago. This park is really, really sick though, man. I guess this one's like some weird shit. It's so good. So it's like, got this massive bowl right here. It's not massive, it's like a, that looks like a six foot bowl right there. Got the, the death gap. Nice transitional wall. Some level changes, a nice curved ledge. It's got some coping on it all the way around from the back side of that wall. It's kind of a gnarly spot for it. But hey, get in where you fit in in this place. Then you got this Euro here. This thing like comes down that, and, like launches you down into this. This thing is huge. Like this right here is steep as hell. Like stupid steep. Got like your, it's like a, like a three foot vert wall. It kind of, it goes to like vert right here. It's like really steep too. That transition down there is a lot more mellow. It, it's pretty, it's pretty dope. It's still tall. It's like, that's, that's easily six foot. That's probably six and a half foot. Probably right at six foot. Yeah. Then you got this. Here's another Euro gap right here. Nice big Euro. This thing is massive. Look how long this is. I can put my board in here and it's still not to the end of the Euro. Like, I guess that puts it into perspective. It's pretty cool. I got coping there to keep you from deck checking. Look at that. Hello. Dude, that is freaking massive and then it just goes to the noping wall of death my lord this stuff's sick over here but this is a uh, this is not i haven't i don't really get to skate this kind of stuff all the time it's not really my my forte i guess i need to start skating it more i'm gonna put my knee pads on if i come down here yes that's right i said my knee pads because i need to take care of myself So, this right here is sick. I really like this. This is like a outledge thing. That's really sick. Like, I like this a lot. Like, this is, this is dope right here. The little three block. Yeah, that's sick. That curved ledge over there. These are always cool. These little up, up ledges. This one's kind of tall, but shit, that's sick. Badass. Come from that way, come over here, hit that. And you got this bowl that's gnarly as hell, like a legit swimming pool. The last time I was here, this thing had a shit ton of water in it. Um, it's like a, a clover bowl. Um, but all the coping is like murderous. It's all jacked up and the tiles like down in the bottom of there. So I won't be skating that. City of Omaha, come fix your stuff. Uh, and then you got this ledge, this little curved ledge right there. You know, average, pretty fun. Probably get, get something on that. And then you got these bad boys. Freaking massive hubbas. So it's like, it's like good right there at the top, you'd think. And you know, it's really not that tall to get on it, but dude, the, the drop right here is like, it ends up getting to like that, like. Sheesh. I'm just a poser, so I can't really skateboard. So that's why I don't want to skate this. I just don't want to get hurt. This rail right here is, is sick though. What is this, a 10, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. Man, look at me. I'm smart. I'm out of count. Um, got that. 
this is where I'm going to be skating at. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. Like, this is my stuff. Y'all know, like, the little, got the nice little curve ledge, got a good ledge right here, got the little bank wall thing, get creative on that. Then you got this China Gap. Nice little China Gap. Pretty sick. With the coping over the top ledge. Got this rail with the Euro. But the ground is like shit water. I can like put my foot in that. Yeah, you won't be rolling over that today. This right here has got a knock taken out of it. The same things at the bottom of those two uh, deals over there. So it looks like that ledge is that and the transition over there is what I'm gonna be skating. This is, dude, this is so tall. Yeah, uh, right on your, on your genitalia. It's not so tall, but it is, it's pretty tall, man. This one over here looks very doable though. This one, this one is, is dope. I like this one. This one looks like people have been having some fun over here skating this one. The last time I was here, all this was holding water. That rail over there looks very sick too. I'm about to go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably hit one of these handrails. Probably, man, I just don't know about this one. This one's long, dude. This one is long. It's a little, like nice little double set. I know the Shreveport homies will be having a blast here. So, got that. Got this nice little square flat bar. Get some tricks on that. That's, you know, these, these little things, these are, these are right up my alley, man. I wish I had the machismo to do the other shit, but I don't. This rail sends you straight to the ground. Holy shit. It goes like right into the ground. I could skate the set, but the rail's like, I guess I could skate the rail too, not be a puss, but it definitely sends you straight into the ground. Oh man. I guess let's uh, get some stuff on this flat bar here. This is gonna be kind of a short video. Uh, I say a short video, it's already seven minutes long, but um, yeah, I'm gonna just try and make the end of this video clip. So uh, let's get it. Wow cracked my trucks that's crazy man that's my back truck too i don't even know like what could i have been doing crack my truck i'm not gonna lie these crooks no offense crooks i love the way they grind and love the way they slide and all that good stuff but man when i bought these like that piece right there on the hanger chipped off like within a week like it chipped it didn't get grinded down it just chipped off like that little piece right there what else happened? I thought something else happened with them. I think that's it. They took a while to like break the bushings in. They're straight, but they don't stay tight. Like when you tighten them up, they don't stay tight. And now this is cracked. I'm gonna keep skating them, but man, that's kind of that's kind of worrisome. I'm kind of sad about that, honestly, because I really don't want to buy new trucks. Damn, I got the grooves though. Got the grooves, though. It's time to get new trucks anyway. I've been skating them pretty hard. Got the grooves, though. All right, let's see if I can get a couple more things here before my trucks decide to break. 